What the hell is going on? Officer At the hacker space. Move. It just stands in the middle of the road. Move. Move. <laughs> the heck is happening over here, man? You leave for two seconds to take up, take down a church and everything goes to hell. Yo, Wrench. Yo, Em. Damn, man, I hope you kept the receipts. Hey, yo, check out this fuck stick. So tell us about Home 2.0. <laughs> Home systems are completely bulletproof. Your privacy is absolutely secure. Bold claim, Steven. Aren't you worried hacker groups will see that as a challenge? Well, say what you mean, Shirley. Dead sec. Now, if they want to go up against us, I invite them to try. <laughs> Home 2.0 is an OS with teeth. Yo, he called us out by name? Yep. He don't know who he fucking with. It's on now. Yeah, that's why I've been trying to crack 2.0. There's just one... See? Little problem. What? Here. This stand back right. Chip. It's a little oh, hard to get out. Look, there's no point in trying to use the previous version's hardware to jack the new OS. Why? Because they changed the ports. Following the capital sky to force obsolescence. Uh, but luckily. A little birdie told me that 2.0 should be packing a farm fresh zero day. Ooh, now that might just be a shame. Damn right. And that is why you, my friend, are going to hijack me a 2.0 pre order shipment before some do gooder white hat tells home how to cock block us. Got a weird relationship with technology. You know that, right? He didn't mean it. A San Francisco group of hackers has exposed New Dawn's religious secrets. DedSec revealed footage of New Dawn's temple area and demonstrated that the so called ancient artifacts were simply fakes of what New Dawn claimed were ancient tablets. Members of the hacker group managed to infiltrate the highly guarded compound and capture the secret of organization's methods of control over members, including movie star Jimmy Siska. New Dawn declined our request for an interview. Of course they did. Coming. That's gonna get a reaction from Bloom. I can't believe people let them grab so much power. All that sci-fi shit we read as kids. Big Brother, Thought Control, Pre-Crime. It's all here now, isn't it? Thanks to Bloom and their CTOS. Those authors saw it coming decades ago, but nobody listened. Everybody's too sold on pleasant corporate platitudes and flawless branding to realize the whole damn thing's a societal Trojan. It doesn't help that CTOS actually does what they say it does either. We're opposing a system that helps people on the surface, but exploits them behind the scenes. Makes it easy to paint us as the bad guys. Question for you. How much access does DedSec have to CTOS? In other cities, when it was still CTOS 1.0, we had a lot. Sucks because we were too careless. Missed our window to do something big. In 2.0, we're the first group to go up against it. Though we're still playing catch up. They were expecting us this time. The thought of dead sec written on a whiteboard in some bloom office makes me all squishy inside. We keep it up. Next time, maybe they'll use the red marker. Okay, I'm at Holmes Distribution Center. Great. Okay, uh, so take a look around for a computer, one of those old crap box ones. Now, Holmes stores their schedules based on number plate destination combinations, like some kind of barely literate moron. 
If that one was, you know, a company. <laughs> Good to know. I'll see what I can find. So now marks kind of the beginning of a new strategy I'm going to use. The overall strategy is basically the same, distract, but this is a much more interesting distract. I like to send gang members into uh, whoever's holding me between what I need and watch them fight and do different little ways. It doesn't always work smoothly, but this kind of marks a new era. Before what I was doing was I was distracting them with knocking people out in the electromagnetic bubble thing. And then, um, so now my new thing is going to be sending gangs in there and watch them devour themselves. And now, and then just waltz right in there with, with no, with no resistance. Now the fun thing about this is you can use this a lot of times in this game. Hold on. Where are you? Got it. The fun thing it hold on. I got the list. Okay, great. So now all you have to do is stroll over to the distribution center and match the number plate of one of their trucks to the one that's headed downtown. Man, this is so analog. I told you. Luddites. The fun part about this is the fact that you can use this in a lot of missions, but it doesn't always work so smoothly. So I'm going to go and see how long this works in different situations. And um, let me show you what I mean. So I have to hack this key first, first and foremost. Um... And it uh, looks like the key is moving, so it's on somebody. It's on somebody personally. Now, in order to get rid of these people, I'm just gonna send a gang in here. I'm trying to see if one of these are him. Ooh, I could have got him right there. Does he come up to the window? It doesn't look like he does. So maybe I should just. Oh, cause I want to get that money bag too. Maybe I should just stir things up. Let me see. I usually try to like to find the furthest gang member. And uh oh. Alright, well let's try to use this. Maybe I can get it by going down. Is he there? Right there, got him. Hacked him. Alright, so now I'm sending gang in. Which guard member am I gonna send the gang after? I'm trying to think. Probably the furthest one so that they'll have to go further and fight more people before they get there. I don't have like the real powerful gar uh, gang invasion thing. So, which I'm going to upgrade to that quick. So I'll probably just get this guy up here. What do you think? Come on. All right, let's get our bots back real quick. I gotta move out the way because they're gonna be blasting. Here they come. Here they are right here. They're not the strongest gang members, so they might just die right away. Hopefully. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Where's he? I forgot they call for. Where's the reinforcements guy? Oh, well. More fighting, the better. Let's try to get some botnets back. Take his money. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll just keep following him. Botnets. Oh, they tore my gangsters up. But there's more coming, though. That's the whole thing. I feel bad for these innocent people. Oh, look, more. What are the, what's the black car? The black car is Bravada. Okay. Or Bra Bratva. Nope. You ain't calling nobody, fam. Let's go. 
Oh, I'm all out of botnets. I need to I need to get botnets from somebody. Can I get them from the gang members? No, he just explodes. What about these guys? Auntie Shoe Boys are in town. Let's go. So we got we got security guards, Bratva, and Auntie Shoe. That's what I'm talking about. Let's just clear this place out, fam. Clear it out. Who's who's calling for backup? Oh, right there. Ah, it's too late. It's too late. It's too late. It's too late. Oh, get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. All right. Throw it back up real quick. So now the police are here. So it's going to be... It's going to be security, police... Oh, no. That's just security. I'm trying to get out of here because I'm not trying to get shot out this piece. Auntie Shoe Boys are in, uh, in conflict with security guards. So I'm just moving out the way. I'm letting everybody fight real quick. I'm going to do a couple of missions like this. I don't think they all work like this, but I'm going to show you something real fast. We're going in here to get this cash. Because before you do the mission, you have to get the cash first. If you don't get the cash first, which I've learned, literally you could miss out on the cash because the mission ends. So we got to go ahead and find this cash. All right, how much cash is this? $5,000. It's not bad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Got a research point too. Now, we should be able to just kind of waltz right into this place. I, I don't even, I wasn't even thinking. I don't even know why I went. I could go in through the front door, I think, but I'm just so accustomed to just going around. All right, let's see. I found the truck. Great, now what are you waiting for? Smash and grab, my friend. Simple as that, man. Simple as that. I could have went left, but it's looking tight over there. And, uh... the shipment and I'm inbound. I already know what it is. These people are always in a whoa, middle finger, huh? All right, you better not be there when I get back out. Standing in the way. Giving me the middle finger. Why is it always fighting outside the... Look at outside. Wait a minute. Hey, tell me I got something good. Want me to get you two coffee? No, he's a robot. I want you to get us caffeine. You'll take a decaf. <laughs> oh, no! 
Yo, did you hear all that fighting outside during the cutscene? Like, we this is a dangerous place we're in right now. Every time I come back here, there's people shooting and explosions. Oh my god. This man's got a bottle of wine and a Optimism. Hey guys, the zero day worked. I'm in. Awesome work, Marcus. Take a look around inside the house. Home stores all their user data locally as a part of their security guarantee. If you can access the footage of people checking out the house, that'll be enough to sound the alarm. Got it. All right, so I don't have the ability to hack the home's laser securities or anything yet. So I'm going to have to get a little creative with this. We can get in from the top. So I'm going to go ahead and call, put the um, put the jumper back down. I'm going in from the roof this time instead of the vent like I did last time. The first time I played, I should say. Oh, it was already open. That's right. All right, here we go. Ha! All right. All right, we in. All right, where are we going? We got to get over there, which is 15 meters. 15 meters. Let him pass. And just go ahead around him. What about his buddy over there? Oh, he can't see nothing either. Alright, so let's see. Oh no, so there's nothing over here, but I remember that's where we gotta come to end this mission. So now I know where it's at. There we go. Oh, sh okay. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Wait till he goes by. All right, he's going back the other way. Now, where is this guy going? Because this guy's turning around. My God. Okay, perfect. All right, all right. Good, good, good. This is perfect configuration. He's going that way. He's coming back this way. What about this guy outside? Will he see me? No, there's a wall there. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 
All right, let's get back up the steps and get to that's where the other that's the other place. That's Welcome where I first home, went. The smart house of the future. As you enjoy your tour of our facilities, please take the time to truly engage with the space. Touch, feel, open, and use every object or item as you so wish. This is your experience, your journey. And when the time comes to make your decision, remember, it's not a house unless it's a home. All right, here we go. Why is the lights on now? Here comes a robot. Pull it back. All right. Easy peasy. Uh, I'm not. Oh, uh, there's money there. All right, let's let's go get the money. Why not? It looks like this would be easy. I'm just gonna put the copter or the the jumper in there, and then quickly call it back as soon as it picks up the thing. So look, all you gotta do, yeah, yeah, it's easy. Ain't no people or nothing here. It's just robots, robots that don't shoot or do nothing. Put this here. Ha! The rule is get the money first. That's the rule, but with this, it's only five thousand dollars. But with this, I did it backwards. Um, don't do it backwards. Get the money first, and then do the mission if you're gonna do it that way. Because some of the missions end, and uh, sometimes you're under more heat when you do whatever you have to do to get the people away. I don't know. Maybe that's bad advice, but that's just the rules that I follow. Anyway. Oh, is this the owner of the house? Venture capitalist. Let's see what she's got to say. Have you seen the latest home display? Oh, you must have. I can't wait for 2.0 to be a I saw it at game. your house. I haven't had the pleasure yet. What's the highlight reel? Well, everything in the house is connected. You can set up your home theater to play the film of your choice and make popcorn in the kitchen. All with the press of a single button. Oh, and there's a romance setting with dim lighting and mood music what it's such a shame they won't let me move into the model home rather than waiting for my free upgrade i've offered them six figures but they simply won't budge hm. waiting for the release of new tech is so la damn Hey guys, the server was a bust. What do you mean? You had access. It's just a relay point. The data's being stored off-site. No, 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 no. That's not how this hardware works. I if they'd installed something different, I... Josh? You still there? Looks like he's speed reading a series of intercompany memos. We'll get back to you on the how. You chase up the why. On it. 